guys and welcome back to another episode out of star made on the star squadron server um i've been building a little bit uh down here but today what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to build a factory all right so what i want to do is i want to be able to manufacture consistently um certain parts um haul I want to be able to manufacture most of the colors consistently so that at any point if I decide to change a color on something, I got that going. So down here, I'm going to go one layer down and then we're going to build a wall of factories. And I'm not sure if I want it to all lead into one spot or if I'm going to have it separated by the different types um, like over here I'm gonna do paint over here I'll do haul then maybe I'll do like machine parts uh, or not machine parts uh, ship parts and maybe over here do like weapons or something as long as it's continuously producing, I don't have to have it producing a lot. I just have to have it producing. So that's the goal here. So I'm going to get this floor dug out and get busy on putting in a wall. And we'll catch up here in a little bit when I got some more done. Okay, so I got this filled in. Um, I accidentally filled this in with stone, but no big deal. Not going to worry about it. Uh, so... Here's what we're going to do. We want to make this. First, let's go right where we're going to have that. So, this is the chest where all this is going to go. Uh, we're going to start out with paint. I believe there's eight different colors of paint. Whoops. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight. That work? I believe so. Okay. So I'm just gonna pull out of all, all out of here. All right. So these eight are gonna produce paint. That's gonna go into there, and then we'll start the hall blocks here okay so I think I figured out what we're doing and uh, this is going to be our ore processing that's all going to go there now we have to put a refinery over here and that way we can just bring everything into here well, actually, we'll have a docking area for a salvage ship that will have a chest that will lead to these. And then we'll put the ore refinery here. Okay, so I'm like prepared. All right, so first things first, we got to set each one of these up to produce paint. I just got to get them all set up, and that way we have that part done. So I'm going to get that done, and we'll be right back. Okay, so now I got this set up a little bit. Um, so far I got the each item producing paint. And I got it all going into here. Uh, one thing I do need to change though. Is I am going to connect this to all of these. Okay, the reason I did that is because this will produce a lot over time, and I want it to just pull when I need it. Um, we're going to pr be producing a lot of haul, but 
not all right now. So anyways, a lot of these resources like the black paint pulls the tech it. I want carp tech it. White paint is a car a dollum. I want to be able to produce carved dollum. So yeah, we're gonna keep that with an activation switch and only we'll probably have it going for the most part. You know, full time, but right now we're gonna just make sure we can have it off. So now it's just a matter of figuring out where I want everything and getting that set up. Um, these are just producing one. I have no factory enhancers on them. Um, I will probably be taking these down and this wall is actually going to probably start about here so that I have room in the back for the enhancers. That way we can accommodate what we need. So yeah, that is the plan. Alrighty, so I'm going to get on this, get it a little bit further along, and we'll see what we have then. Okay, well, first things first, in order to produce a hull, we're going to need to produce gray hull. So our first bit of business is going to be gray hull. And this we are actually going to put right next to there. And we're going to put Well, let's find it. Gray hall. Okay. And this is going to be pulling directly from here and here. And we want to have a few of these Let's go four high, I guess. That gives us a little bit of room there. Okay, so that'll produce quite a bit. In fact, it is. Hmm, I'm wondering, should we go more than that? I don't know. This is going to be our little uh, factory enhancer room. Yeah, let's go with that. Okay, and we will put an activation switch. Put connect that to that. There. Okay. So that gives us our gray hull. And then from here, we need to put each individual hull with an activation switch next to it. Alright, so everything is connected now, I believe. Everything has its own switch, but we're going to need a master switch. So we'll have the master for the paint, so we don't need another one there. Let's undo that. Go. Go hall. And we'll have to label these later. I don't like the way that looks. Alright, so let's go here. Alright, and then we'll select that one. Oh, no, shift V. 
V. And so if you hold shift, put it on one, it's going to select that whole section. So this is our master switch for all of these. Because at any point, if I need to stop production, I can. Okay, now all these seem to be off. Now they're on. And now they're off. Nice. So that is going to produce all the hull that we need, I believe. Hopefully. Okay. I didn't know his machine was on, but he is on. And, uh... I also realized that uh, we're going to need a lot more of these because each one of these, like say this one here, is going to produce a black hull. So it has to produce a black hull plus one for each of these. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have each one of these produce approximately 10 maybe. So if this is producing 10, four of those are Three of those will be used for this, and that'll leave me seven because we're going to use a lot more square blocks than corners or angles or wedges and stuff. And some will need more than others, so at that point, if we don't need something specifically, then we can always go ahead and just cut it off with the switch. So, that'll work. But, as for right now... I need a whole bunch of these. Oh, where did those go? There we go. So I'm going to get some of these done and get them connected up. And then we got to start getting it producing hull. Okay. So I got the gray hull producing quite a bit. I'm still not sure it's going to be enough, but we can change that later. And each one of these is going to have its own section here. So that they are producing enough. And with everybody getting on and off this, the server, this will be loaded quite a bit. So it will pretty much almost always be producing something. And a lot of times I'll just get on and goof around while it's doing stuff, or I'll be AFK or something. So, not worried about the volume it's going to produce necessarily. I just want to make sure it produces it kind of evenly. And so that we don't end up with a million, you know, black hall wedges and no black hall. So, all right, so that way it will actually produce 10 of every hull, and then for every 10 hull, it's going to produce one of each of these. So, seven hulls and one of each of these is what it comes out to total. And uh, hopefully, this is going to be enough because if it's not, then I have to start stretching it around the sides. And this over here, that is going to be my weapons wall. So, so that's going to work. And this I will fill in as we go for which parts are which. So, all right, I'm going to get to working on that. Okay, so I boo booed. There are more than I thought. I uh, forgot wedges. So I have to go through and add wedges to each one of these. Alrighty, so I think I've got this all set up and uh, down to right around in here. I, mean, oh, I guess that doesn't help me any. I thought I indicated where. Anyways, so I have all the hull colors being manufactured and still had room to spare. 
uh, so I did a few others. Um, let's go ahead and activate this. Let's see. Wow, I'm going to need more of these. So, let's go ahead and do those, those, those. See if it actually picks up. <laughs> no. <laughs> I am going to have to make a whole bunch of these. Forty six. Okay, it's still not as much as I want because I want to produce a lot more. Let's check. So let's see. Four eighteen, four thirty six. So that's a little bit better. Alrighty. Power depleted. So I'm definitely going to have to work on power. Alright, so let's go ahead and turn those off. Turn that off. Hmm. All right, so power system. Now I have this out here, which is not the most efficient, but I wanted to keep it looking good. So maybe our next step is to make a gigantic battery. So it looks like I'm running out of time. In the next episode, hopefully we'll have this done and we're gonna take a quick look around the planet and do just a little tour see what everybody else is doing all right but as for now thanks for watching have a great day bye bye